Hello everybody, in this short video I'm going to be covering how to use the concatenate function in Google Sheets. Concatenate lets you combine cell contents from two or more cells. So um, for this example I have first names in column A, last names in column B, and I want to combine them together. If this was a huge file, some people that don't know how to use concatenate might start typing the names out manually if they need to merge it into one cell. Um, if I have a bunch of lines in the file, that's going to take forever. Um, whenever you're working in Google Sheets or Excel, you want to be able to use the program to do work efficiently. Concatenate is a function here that will save you a lot of time when you learn how to use it, and it's really simple to use. So all you do to use concatenate is um, you start the formula with an equal sign, you type concatenate, you find the one you want. Um, concatenate here. I don't want to do this bottom one. Concat um, that only lets you do two values. Concatenate will let you do as many as you want. So when I find the one I want, I hit tab and it lets me start the formula. So I click on my first cell that I want uh, merged into one cell and then I do a comma and then I click on the other cell and then I close out the formula with the parentheses. So just doing the concatenate function, it doesn't allow a space in there. Um, what you have to do is you have to put a quotation marks, space, quotation marks, and then a comma um, in between the two cells that you want. And then you hit enter, and then you can just copy the formula down, and it, um, it puts the space in between the names. You can combine as many cells as you want. So if I wanted to combine three cells like this, it would be the same thing. Um, equals concatenate, and then I just put in the cells I want merged together. Um, so I accidentally did the concat formula again, which uh, you don't want to use. You want to use concatenate. That's the one you want. So you can see it did um, three different cells into one. You can also use concatenate to um, insert words. So if, what I mean by that is if I'm just going to use concatenate here, um, I can put in these quotation marks, maybe like first name, and then quotation marks, comma, and then maybe I just want to add the first name in um, like that. You can do that. Uh, maybe I'll just put a space in there so it looks a little neater. So there's a lot of different ways you can use concatenate, um, but you can see once you learn the ins and outs of it, it should save you a lot of time. I'm sure you can think of many reasons you could use it.